Hey guys, today I want to take a closer look at the service host executable, SVC host, and why it's causing such a high CPU load in some machines. If you have just logged into your machine and this process is consuming too much CPU, more than, than 0 or 5, then it's uh, very possible that this is uh, a virus if it's in a different folder location than the system32 folder. In order to find out the folder location of this process, simply right click on the process. It's best to start at the top and work your way down. Uh, you right click on the process and click on open file location. In the address bar it should say C Windows System32. If it's stored in a different location, like C rootkit or whatever, maybe not that obvious, but in a random folder, then it's uh, very likely a virus. Should you find any suspicious files in a random folder, like C rootkit, it's uh, a good idea to download a software called Malwarebytes from malwarebytes.org. Uh, it's totally free. You should perform a full scan on your entire system. After removing any viruses or rootkits, uh, you need to analyze the process in more detail. And in order to do that, we are going to download a tool called Process Explorer by SysInternals. Open the program and locate all of the service host executables. And uh, should you see uh, any executable called AudioDG that is causing really high CPU load, uh, it's possible that your audio drives are incompatible or corrupt. Also, look for any other processes that are causing a high CPU load and locate the respective drivers for that specific process and update it to a newer version. After updating your drivers and removing any suspicious files and viruses, your CPU issues should be gone. Uh, that's it for now. If you have any questions, post a comment below.